वेलकम टू इट्स टुमारो न्यूज आई एम हेना तलाटी फर्स्ट मेजर विंटर स्टॉम ऑफ 2024 कुड ब्रिंग स्नो टू यूनाइटेड स्टेट्स वेदर मीटरोलॉजिस्ट आर ट्रैकिंग व्हाट्स एक्सपेक्टेड टू बिकम द फर्स्ट मेजर विंटर स्टॉम ऑफ 2024 व्हिच कुड ब्रिंग द फर्स्ट सिग्निफिकेंट स्नो इन 2 इयर्स फॉर सेवरल सिटीज अलोंग द ईस्ट कोस्ट एंड फ्लडिंग रेन टू द साउथ all translating to messy weekend travel across the eastern united states the storm is forecast to develop from friday along the gulf coast an area of low pressure will develop late friday and move up the east coast heavy rain and gusty winds will likely create significant travel disruptions for the south confidence is increasing for the impactful snowfall in the mid atlantic and northeast parts of the interstate 95 corridor could be seen over an inch this nearly 2 year streak without the inch of the snow for the philadelphia smashed the previous record streak of 661 days without an inch of snow that ended in 1973 new york city long ago clubbed the old record of 383 days without an inch of snow that ended in 1998 New York City only saw 2.3 inches of the snow over the winter of 2023 through all the 2023. That is more than a 2 foot deficit compared to average winter season snowfall and a record for the lowest annual snowfall total. Philadelphia and Washington both saw less than half inch leaving those cities with the 22.8 inch and 30.3 inch deficit respectively. The storm is expected to impact at least 20 states from Texas to New England. The Gulf Coast could see another round of the heavy rain triggering flood concerns. The interstate 10 and 20 corridors and the southern portions of the I-95 corridor will deal with wet pavement. The storm will then slide northward near or off the east coast as it collides with the cold air. Anyone living from West Virginia to New England could be in the heavy snow. Forecasters say there is a growing threat of freezing rain where the rain changes over the snow. Western North Carolina to Virginia could see significant icing putting a slippery glaze on the pavement and weighing down the tree limbs and power lines an area of low pressure is expected to develop between the Houston and New Orleans on Friday producing heavy rain along the gulf coast flash flooding is possible from southeastern and eastern texas eastward to florida panhandle as the area is under the heavy rain currently Temperatures across large swaths of Canada will continue to remain at least 5 degrees Celsius above the average through this week. In some areas there will be extreme difference in the temperature from the seasonal norm notably for the parts of Alberta, Manitoba and Ontario where daytime maximums could be 20 degrees Celsius higher than the average. Records have already been broken across the southern British Columbia as the weather stations recorded highs of 12.9 degrees Celsius on 27th December surpassing the previous record set in 1922. Temperatures in the west Vancouver then smashed the previous temperature record by 2.5 degrees Celsius on 29th December as temperatures reached 14 degrees Celsius. That's all for now. For more news updates stay tuned with us it's tomorrow news for more global weather updates like this subscribe our channel and hit the bell icon for regular updates